What's up guys and welcome to a crazy world of Samsung where anything can happen. We have an insane new Samsung smartphone design, a fully bezel-less smartphone with dual screen, chameleon AI powered monster with hidden cameras and no ports. This is by far the craziest Samsung patent in a while. Also, we are fast approaching the official launch of the S21 series. So some final S21 Ultra specs are here as well. Plus Samsung has secured a huge win over Apple. Now we have seen some crazy smartphone designs that are not meant for average consumers like the Xiaomi Mi Mix Alpha. It's a product that shows off the ultimate tech muscles of a brand, which is exactly what this Samsung smartphone design really is. So the patent shows off a completely bezel-less smartphone with not just one display, it's got two full-on bezel-less displays. It's also having a surround display design, meaning the display curves all the way around, giving it an extremely futuristic look. Now, one of the displays can slide to reveal the underscreen front camera and all the sensors. And because the rear side of the phone is also having a display part, the back cameras can be used for taking selfies. Samsung shows off multiple examples of how applications can just flow to the side of screen, taking advantage of all that real estate. Now it's not just your typical crazy bezel-less edgy phone because according to this patent, this phone has some crazy AI functions. The phone is constantly scanning the environment and adapting to it. For example, if it's raining outside, then there will be a rain animation just flowing on the edge of the display. And depending on the weather, it can change the information seamlessly Samsung mentions the predefined graphic elements used for this phone. That's just one example. It can also show off information regarding your activities, your health, or training information. This is possible because of the camera which has some chameleon functions as well. It can fully detect colors which means if you put it on a green surface or on a brown surface, the phone will change color, matching kind of a similar wallpaper to that surface. And honestly, it sounds really, really cool. Now, interestingly, there is no USB Type-C port on this phone for charging, so it can only be charged wirelessly for a true wireless smartphone experience. We know other brands like Apple, they're already planning to do something like this probably next year. Who knows, the future of smartphone industry could truly be wireless. And this is the first time a patent from Samsung is showing off a no port design. So in the world of Mi Mix Alpha and Swivel LG phones, it's not hard to imagine that something like this can happen in reality. Again, not for average consumers, of course, for those who can afford this kind of crazy tech. I honestly love these new design ideas. Uh, they do bring a new sort of excitement to the smartphone world. Now getting back to the present reality, the Samsung Galaxy S21 Ultra, key specifications are pretty much confirmed. So according to Ice Universe, the S21 Ultra will bring back a feature that Samsung dropped with the Note 20 family and that is 45 watt of fast charging support. Of course, you won't be getting that fast charger out of the box. You will have the 20 watt fast charger which is still pretty fast. The display will finally run at Quad HD 120Hz mode, 108mm ISOCELL HM3 sensor and 5000 mAh battery is on the cars. It's looking good but the most exciting part of this phone is going to be the Exynos 2100 processor. This this is the chip for the international markets and we have yet to see its proper performance so I'm definitely looking forward to that. Speaking of Exynos chip, tomorrow Samsung will be officially announcing its Exynos 1080 processor in China. So stay tuned for all that coverage, be sure to subscribe. Now last but not least, Samsung has just taken a lead over Apple in the USA market where Apple is generally very dominating. It's been three years since this happened and the reason why it happened is because Apple actually delayed the iPhone 12 series which gave Samsung momentum. Now even with the new iPhone 12 series, I don't think this momentum will slow down that much because Samsung will be coming out with the Galaxy S21 series in just one and a half months time so Samsung might still keep its lead. As for world's best-selling smartphone that is still the reigning defending champion the iPhone 11 for some reason this phone is just so so incredibly successful and not just the iPhone 11 the iPhone SE 2020 surprisingly took over everyone and it's right now on the second position. We have some budget Galaxy A series phones, again no S or no series phone anywhere in the list. Hopefully in the future if Samsung launched some affordable flagship level phones like the S21 FE at the right time then that phone can also be in the list. So yeah, that's all the latest news. Let me know your thoughts in the comments section below about this crazy dual screen bezel-less portless phone and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.